many women in Oshun, 26-year-old medical student Costly Aderi Bibwe only found out she had been cut as an adult. Didn't know I was circumcised until I clocked um, 24. And based on research, I discovered that Oshun State has the highest prevalence in Nigeria. I decided to go back home and ask my parents that I hope I wasn't mutilated and then I was told that I was mutilated. Through her NGO, Value Female Network, Costly and her team spend time supporting survivors and raising awareness about FGM. Her team also helps former cutters find alternative means of employment. They said even if they, they should tell us that they're, they're stopping it, they will still go behind the doors to do it because they get money from it and that is how they survive. So we saw that as a major challenge. We were able to empower seven traditional cutters in Ocean State. And then um, I tell you that those traditional cutters, we, we are still in tune with them. We, 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 we're following them up. And even they, those seven had empowered three more cutters and they are not they are no longer circumcising girls you para give this ba ye mi ati gba ti mo ti mo nipa ka mo da be fun omo obirin mo mo ti je go mo nkan ti an se ko ba ko ba ko ye ko ri be ta de ti ngba te de ti so beyen ati ati ji pada pe ko si ro kan beyen mo ati nje ka mo yan mo wi pe ko da ka mo da be fun obirin instead of being depressed had found joy in seeing that, oh, some people had actually stopped this procedure, some babies are free, they are left old, some girls are left old. However, there are still challenges facing her and her team. So the law is not well enforced, and then even the penalty is not with enough. It's not enough to deter a perpetrator from performing the act. But Costly is committed to turning things around in Ocean State. Things has really, really improved. There were times that we've got into communities and they, they chased us out. But this, now that there are laws and they know that it's against the law of the land, most of them, they accept us, they listen to what we want to say. At least that served as an entry point for us to get into the hearts of those who really want to talk to.